Greetings, YouTube. It is so late. Of course, if you cross the pond, I guess it's early. It is past midnight Central Standard Time, and I should be asleep. But I had to talk about, because I'm finally able to talk about it after a long day, what you Cavalier and Thronebreaker players are looking at with the March Daily Cards. Now, this is one of those rare daily cards that overlap, although I guess it's becoming more common now than before. I enjoyed the previous Paragon daily cards because it was all about Tier 6 Basic and Tier 3 Alpha. That's what I cared about most as I'm looking to take more 6 stars to rank 4, of course. But Kabam decided to ditch that model and go with a older model of six star six stone crystals and six star shards. We saw a um, thirty thousand six star shard for thirty dollars price tag, which on paper pretty good for Paragon players. Not amazing, but pretty good. The thirty. Six star six stone crystals, which I still wish they were generics. Five of the Nexus um, regular Cav Nexus crystals. And for Paragons, I think the most important part of this was the 100% tier 5 class catalyst selector because I can target and use up uh, what I need to to help take my next champion to rank 4. Which, spoiler alert, is going to be a Mystic Champion. So you can uh, look at the rank threes that I have and start to theorize. Because I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 Mystic rank threes. One of them will be going to rank four tomorrow slash today, again, depending on what time zone you're watching this from. But I have several of you, including my main man, Mr. Linus Blanket, who always hits me up right at noon Central Standard Time when the new offers come out and sends me what they are. Now, Cavalier players, same price, 30 American dollars, 10,500, so almost a third less than uh, what I get. So from instead of 30,000, 10,000. So really it's 66% less. And 25% tier 5 class Callus Fragment Selector, that is of course 75% less. The five Cavalier Nexus Crystals are uh, the same. And it appears zero six star six stones. So Cavalier players for 30 bucks one-third the six-star shards, 25% uh, of the Tier 5 Class Callus Fragment Selectors, zero, literally, of the six-star six stones, and 100% the same Cavalier Nexus Crystals. The Throne Breakers, who, again, just need some rank four, a lot of you at least, need some rank four, more rank four six-stars to become Wallet Breaker slash Paragon. You have the same number of Cavalier Nexus Crystals, but also... Half the six-star shards, and unlike Cavalier players that at least had some percent of a selector, you would think that Kabam would have given Thronebreakers a 50% tier 5 class catalyst fragment selector. Oh no, it's a 100% class-based crystal, which I say this all the time, for guaranteed value, a 100% crystal is worse than a 50% selector. Why? Because the selector, of course, you get to target the class you uh, need, Whereas a crystal is a 1 out of 6 RNG, which is like, what, 16% of a chance? And you don't control it. It's all by chance. And the RNG for these crystals typically gives you the class you need the least of. That's why you automatically usually have the most of the same, say, 5-star Awakening Gems. So if you get 5 or 6 in a row of tech or science or whatever, well, there's a method behind that madness. And that method behind the madness is indeed the notion that you will not get the class that you are targeting. Sometimes you get lucky, but that's very, very rare. So Thronebreaker, 
even this um, this banner looks deceiving. Thronebreaker, it, you made Paragon look like Cyber Weekend compared to this. Just awful. I would take Cavalier's deal in some ways. Although, obviously, the six-star shards are worse. But in terms of Tier 5 Class Callus, I'd rather take the Selector than the Crystal. So, yuck. I gave the Paragon offer barely a C. I'm giving the Thronebreaker one a D- and the Cavalier one an F. Really disappointing March daily cards overall. The only one worth purchasing really is Paragon, but it's still not something that I'm excited about. Now, if you use your, those six-star shards to get something great, or you do well with Cavalier Nexus, I suppose that's great too. But it's all RNG dependent. It's not guaranteed.